One Nebraska family found their family, their fun family getaway rocked by Hurricane Milton. Right now, they're on a cruise ship that's feeling the force of the Category 4 storm. KETV News Watch 7's Mary Regley sat down with them to talk about their experience. Mary? The group from Lincoln booked a cruise on Royal Caribbean's Harmony of the Seas last December as a Christmas gift. Now the family says this is one trip they won't forget anytime soon. Leaving from Galveston, Texas for the coast of Mexico this past Sunday, they were aware of the potential impacts of the hurricane on their cruise. Their departure was delayed, but initially they weren't too worried about the outcome of the trip. Overnight, things have just gotten a little bit more rocky and a little bit more rocky until we hit today. Now the wind and waves are more intense than they had ever imagined. I still feel perfectly safe, but to say there is zero anxiety would be a pretty bold statement. Two of the three planned portings have been canceled due to the storm, and travelers are still waiting to hear the verdict on the third. I have no doubt we'll get our full six days worth, um, but it may, it could just be doing little circles in the Gulf of Mexico and then heading back. Despite the looming anxiety, the group says they've maintained good humor because that's all they can do. The surfing jokes and the storm jokes and some probably poor taste Titanic jokes. You know, they all fly, but it's, everyone's been really great about it. They say they've been making the most of their unlimited food and drink pass, but they may not plan on another cruise for a long time. It may not be the trip that we have yes. planned for, yes. but it is definitely going to be one that we remember forever. I don't think many of us will cruise again. We've reached out to the Royal Caribbean representative about their storm policies. They say multiple ships are being rerouted, but they can't give us a statement about this particular ship. We've reached out to their media team and we're waiting to hear back with a formal response. Mary Regley, KTV News Watch 7.